Give it up for Give it up for Give it up for Team Elevator Just a little beyond A little beyond And after around two weeks When they brought the meat The dog didn't move Just sat And looked at the meat Yeah Now I'm gonna Allah Boda Doggy The one blame Didn't move and they move it again. Dog starts didn't move. Now below the exact time, the dog started moving away from the meat. And so what they did, they went and took off the chain from the dog. And then they put the meat. And the dog still didn't eat. In fact, from that day, henceforth, the dog never ate meat again. <laughs> but you get my point. That's all. The dog was free. Eventually, the dog was free. There was no chain holding him back. It was free. But his mind had been conditioned that, 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 that he cannot reach the meat. If anything, the meat has become an, an, an enemy. The meat is causing him pain. So the best thing to do for him, even though meat is what the nature of the dog and the purpose, not just dogs in canine, but I belong to the canine family. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. so, so imagine that is what happened to the dog and his soul or they understood. But sometimes we are conditioned by, by the issues of life, we are conditioned by ideologies, wrong ideologies that should not, should not, should not adapt. So, so, by the issues of life, by the challenges of life, and then we become like the dog, we become slaves to our own ideologies. And even when we are free, free and empowered to reach out to that which we deserve, to live according to true nature, the yeah, human existence, then we can't, because we are already conditioned to be biased. There so, is no time to fear the devil, there is no time to be shaken, but there is time to say that the Lord is the strength and the light of my salvation. Hallelujah! Amen. I always feel like speaking and speaking and speaking but today I will leave you and tell the Lord to manifest. I will always pray to you that the light of the Lord will be your salvation. The light of the Lord will light whenever you are in circumstances of darkness because whenever it shines then you are able to be lifted high. You are able to feel that I am in the presence of God and there is nothing in this world that can tremble me. There is nothing in this world that can make me move because the presence of God and the light of the salvation of God is always with me. Be blessed. <laughs>
given us. This is the second time that Team Elevators has come to visit us in our institution. We want to thank you because you have been a blessing to the youth. We, some of us are hopeless, some of us are lost, but we know that the relationship we are building right now is going to build us as the Christian Union of this school, as the children of God in this school. So we thank you very much. You are always welcome in our institution and we will always be together in God. Amen. 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 Thank you. Clap for him. Praise God again. Amen. How are you, people of the Lord? Amen. You are good? Mm. You have enjoyed the yeah. program? Yeah. And I've also enjoyed the program as well. I thank you, Team Elevators. You've been a blessing to us so much today. Some of us, maybe we had lost hope. Some of us, maybe we were in some kind of darkness. But we thank you for your words of encouragement. They have, they have not only got into our mind, they have, but they have touched some spirits. And we thank you for you so much encouraged us. You've encouraged those who are not saved and also us who are saved as well. You've grown us in our spirits and how we pray, how we, how we uh, encourage you to continue coming to our school, to continue visiting us, to continue empower, empowering more and more young lives outside here. So we thank you. You're welcome more and more. And be blessed in your journey. Amen. We continue. Uh, encouraging young men outside here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Be blessed. Be blessed too. Thank you. God. Amen. Uh, my name is Julius Musia, uh, hospital student. And I'm blessed. The day has been good. The day has been great. <laughs> Team Elevators. They have really blessed us. And so I hope that the Lord will bless them more. Well. Amen. Thank you. Clap for him. So, uh, this is uh, Matomato from uh, Team Elevators. And which school is this? Hospital High School. I agree. That was the program. Oh, Yes. Yes. Uh, what do you tell good, good. Uh, thank you so very much. All the best on your studies. Namungo yeah. uh, Goodbye. Yeah.